hi guys welcome back to yis craft house today we're going to be making a dining room and a table and chairs for the dollhouse i started by measuring over 10 inches on my foam board and cut through the board without cutting all the way through so that it could bend then i cut out another 10 inch piece of foam board for the other side then i measured and cut out the floor I went ahead and covered it with wood grain scrapbook paper before I glued everything together. Once the room was glued together, I then drew a window and cut that out. I initially covered it in this tan floral wallpaper, but once all of the walls were done, I didn't like it. I thought it looked too like country for me. So I went back with this purple and gray floral paper and covered all of the walls. So for the chairs, I cut out two rectangles the same size, one for the seat and one for the back of the chair. For the seat, I cut out strips of the foam board and glued it on the underneath to make a little box. Then I glued on some batting just to the top. And then I went in with this red leather looking sheet. I measured and cut and then I glued the leather looking sheet. I glued it onto the, the top of the seat and then I glued it in the middle on all four sides. As for the corners, I came back and made a slit all the way up to the top point and then I cut off the excess and just glued the two sides together. Then I used some dowel rods for the legs. For the back of the chair, I cut out another rectangle and then I cut a small strip of the foam board and then I made little creases in it, the whole length of it. That way I could shape it to glue between the two rectangles. Then I covered the back with the red leather looking sheet as well. I decided I didn't want to spend time making four of these chairs, so I ended up making a bench for the back of the table. I just cut out a strip of foam board and glued smaller strips on the sides to form a little box like we did for the seat of the chair. Then I added some batting and covered it in the leather sheet the same way we did the chair. Then I recovered the walls with this floral scrapbook paper. Then I took some strips of foam board and framed out the window. Next I took some dark gray scrapbook paper and glued it around the bottom of the room. Next I cut some strips of the same gray scrapbook paper and glued it on where the papers meet. Then I added more strips of foam board for the baseboard. For the table, I cut a sheet of foam board the size I wanted my table to be and I had these little thin strips of wood that I got from the Dollar Tree and I glued them on top. I took four strips of foam board and glued them together. Then I took two squares of the foam board, one slightly smaller, and glued them together. Once everything was dry, I glued them all together. I took another one of the wooden sheets from the Dollar Tree and painted it gold and took this silver packaging and glued it on once the paint was dry to make a mirror. Alright guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the thumbs up below and subscribe for more videos and I'll see you back here soon.